Well, look outside right now. It's beautiful out there right now, and it doesn't feel too bad either. No, it, and it's warmer than usual, right, Bob? Eight, nine, ten degrees of Bono, and early this morning cleared out quickly. If you looked out to the east, the clouds were still moving off toward the ocean, but it, boy, it turned out to be a fantastic day. After all the wind and rain we had, boy, it's really, really pleasant. Temperature-wise around the region, Upper 60s to low 70s at the airport. It got up to at least 73 right now in College Park. Columbia and Glen Burnie at 70. Mountain Area at 68. And Towson at 70. Jacksonville, Aberdeen at 68 degrees. And St. Mugles at 69. Winds right now a lot lighter than they were yesterday, that's for sure. Only 8, 9, 10, 12 miles an hour. 15 in D.C. Elkton still a little closer to the center of that low pressure, which is south of New England at 23, but only 11 in Westminster and 11 in Bel Air. So we're not going to be dealing with those strong winds. If you're heading out this evening, clear skies, really, really pleasant. It'll be cool later on, obviously, and the wind's dying down, which means even later on, be back in the 40s most places. So it'll be a little chilly in the morning, but still above normal for this time of year. We've been a really warm month this month and really dry until. Well, yesterday we made up a lot of the deficit. So at 5 o'clock, 66, by 11, about 55, and by 1 a.m., about 52 degrees. Open night tonight, clear skies here, yeah, 48, 49, Dundalk, 48. Close to the water bodies, it'll be warmer. Away from the water, 44, 45, Bel Air, Sykesville at 43. So kind of a cool. And in the morning, we'll call it mainly clear skies. The clouds building in late in the afternoon and tomorrow night. 48 in the morning, but low to mid 60s by midday. So it'll be a pleasant, pretty normal day. We're tracking a next storm system already causing a lot of shower activity and thunderstorms, particularly in Louisiana. Had some tornado activity down there. We won't see the severe weather, but we're going to see rain moving in here, and that'll be on Friday. So we're tracking that low pressure moving off the east coast, taking the clouds with it. Next system, here it comes, already beginning to wind up around Memphis. Cold front to the southwest of us, pushing northward. That'll be actually becoming a stationary front with shower activity all through the day on Friday into Saturday. Now, I think maybe by late in the day, Saturday, could see some breaks, but right now it does not look a, a great start to the weekend at all. Most of the rain on Friday, so it looks like pretty wet. By Halloween, we're hoping all that is past us. <laughs> Should be dry for trick and shooters. We'll say highs in the 60s. I'll call it cloudy to partner cloudy skies for Halloween this year. So by the evening, it should be okay. So we're looking for Friday. Rain on the region, 62 down to 52. Few showers on Saturday, 64. For Halloween, 65, 46, a mix of sun and clouds. But next week, when you know it, gets really pleasant. 66, still above normal on Monday. Same thing for Tuesday. And a little cooler for Wednesday. Once again, not one of these days is really... Below normal, so we're still looking at warmer than normal temperatures.